Well, we're here with Daryl Jones today, and there have been a number of uh, recent developments in his case, as, as we all know, uh, some of which include uh, the following uh, media coverage on Chronicle and other uh, outlets. And Mr. Jones, uh, what would you like to share with us today? Well, first I just wanted to, you know, make sure, Chris, that I was able to thank the many people that came out for me. I really appreciate that, you know what I'm saying, family and friends, you know, and I just don't, don't really support it. Although I had my moment, you know, in terms of, like, I got overwhelmed because I hadn't been there in 30 years and it was like the same building and, you know, just so many things reflected back on me and, you know, the loss of my son and my grandmother and the loss of just who wasn't there and, you know, it just all hit me at once. But having the people here was just a great support, you know, so I wanted to thank everybody. The list is just too long and thank you, but it's definitely a list, you know. As far as the court itself, you know, I still got to let them do what they want to do. I found that ironical, and, you know, in terms of the um, Chronicle article, cause they, you know, in terms of the Chronicle interview, I think they did a great job, and I think they did a true job, you know. And I just thought, like I said, a little ironic that at the end, you know, the district attorney office says that um, we're not going to do this in the public's opinion, you know. We're not going to do this in the public. We're not going to have this, you know, you know, hold this case in the public. And I'm going, well, that's exactly what happened to me, you know, when my case went on. You know, newspaper wrote something every day, inaccurate stuff every day, and the jury was picked from the public, so, you know, it's kind of odd to me, like, you know, why would you want the public to know now? We did it then, you know what I mean? I want the public to know when somebody's really listening, but at the same time, as I have to ask of everybody else, I gotta let them do their job, you know? I'm not gonna debate with them back and forth. The years have already been done, and I'm still doing them, you know? And I'm just gonna count on the justice, and, you know, and the victim's behalf and mine, because somebody has to be fighting for them as well. No matter what somebody thinks of me, you know, and um, you know, hopefully we get the justice equally, and, and we get some, you know, some closure. You know, I'll never see the closure. I'm sure you'll never see the actual closure we want, but we'd like to get some closure. Other than that, Chris, man, it's just you know, it's day for day. You know, I'm waiting, you know, to get back in front of the judge, and I, and you know, and everybody's so good about the judge. You know, I've been in the court so many times, so you know, I don't really make opinions in terms of that. I just like the respect that was given for that day from the judge. At least he listened, you know. And um, I can just hope that that continues to be the case. Other than that, you know, my blessings to everybody, and I just thank for the support. And I hope it continues. And, you know, I count on that one thing that they count on. They say that the public has a short memory, so they count on everybody to forget. And I just hope everybody pays attention, you know. And whichever way you lean, you know, just look at the facts and, and look at the truth and lean to that, you know. And it was another thing, you know, in terms of the Chronicle, one of the things I wanted to make know that, I, that you know, you know, Chronicle couldn't do everything, but one of the things was, you know, I saw that juror again, and she was, you know, talking about how she felt, and I again repeat, I think the forgiveness has to come from me, and I, and I do, I don't, you know, I'm not angry with her, I understand what happened in, in, to me in that courtroom, so, you know, I just want to try to let her know, you know, you know, go on with your life, and, you know, at least she spoke up, and at least she said what the truth was, and God's the best of planets, but I'm not angry, you know, I'm not angry with that individual person, and, that ain't the page I'm going to be on. It was something systematic that helped, happened to me bigger than the Jura, you know what I mean? So I'm okay with that, you know. I, I lived out some surviving it. So other than that, just peace to everybody, to my family, everybody take care, and hopefully we'll, 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 you know, get together again, all right? Peace. In, indeed, Daryl, stay the course, and as you know, uh, how much longer? Not much longer, because no lie can live forever, brother. <laughs>